For this craft, you'll need some crayons, dish soap, black acrylic paint, either a sponge or a paintbrush to paint with, and then either a wooden skewer or a toothpick to use at the end. You'll also need a piece of paper. Uh, cardstock is best. I did not have any cardstock on hand at home, so I'm using a piece of construction paper. If you don't have any craft paper, you can also use a paper plate. Similarly, you don't need to have the washable crayons in order to do this. This is just what I happen to have at home. To start, you're gonna take your paper and your crayons and you can draw with different colors, um, different shapes on the paper. You wanna cover the whole paper in different colors. You can do a rainbow from one edge to the other. You can do random shapes in the middle. Whatever you wanna do, this will be the basis for where your colors will be later. The harder you press down on the crayons, the brighter the colors will be later. Just try not to break them. You should cover your whole paper in colors. Here you can see that I did some big shapes and I did some smaller pieces and I put in a couple of fun shapes just, for, just because. And over here I have a rainbow. You can do any of those. You can do mix of them. Uh, you can even just scribble on the page as long as you get some color on there, that's fine. So I did a couple of different things so that at the end I can show you how they each look. This next step involves the paint, and I didn't want to get my table messy, so I put out some newspaper that I took out of the recycling bin. I also need something to mix my paint on. You can get a paper plate or a bowl, or you can get any kind of cardboard. I just took part of a box out of the recycling bin so that I wouldn't get something else dirty. What we're gonna do is on your mixing plate, whatever you're using, we're going to mix equal parts dish soap and paint. So that means we want the same amount of both. Doesn't have to be exact, but try to get it as close as you can. So I'm gonna start with my dish soap. And you don't need a lot. The paint will go pretty far. So don't worry about making too much. You can always make more later. Try to get those about the same size. And then you're gonna take your brush or your sponge, whichever you're using, and mix them together. You wanna make sure it's all mixed up. You don't want any bubbles, so try to do it slowly so that you're not making black soap. <laughs> Once you have the paint ready, you're gonna take your picture and we're gonna paint over it. So we wanna cover up all of the colors that we just did.
wanna make sure that your whole picture is covered in black. Now we're gonna leave this to dry for a couple hours, or maybe you wanna do this today and then do the next part tomorrow. Just make sure you put your painting somewhere that it's not going to get moved and no one's going to touch it so they don't get paint on anything else. Make sure that you wash off any of your brushes or sponges in the sink or in a cup of water. The paint should come off pretty easily. We just wanna make sure we don't get paint anywhere else. And you're gonna to wanna to wash your hands afterwards in case you got paint on yourself like I did. But also we wanna wash our hands pretty often to make sure that we don't catch the virus and get sick. When your paint has dried completely, you can come back and use either your skewer or your toothpick or another pointy wood substance. And you can draw on the paper by scratching off the paint. So as you go along, you might need to press down a little bit, but not too much. And it'll start. Be careful not to rip it like I did. That's why we use cardstock. You can draw all kinds of designs and the colors underneath will start to show through. Over here is where we had some of the larger colors together. And over here is where we have the rainbow gradients. see on camera but you can see all the different stripes of color that we made earlier and you'll be able to see the different gradient of color so all you have to do is just draw any design or message you want and have fun with it enjoy